given your standing in this program, when you walk into a team meeting like you do today, do you have a different sense of kind of your role amongst the guys and, you know, being a veteran of this program uh, w with some newcomers that are that are now here just getting to lay the land? Um, yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, this year, obviously, with a lot of the freshmen and transfers we got coming in, being a guy who's been here, obviously, for three years, this will be my third year. Um, yeah, it feels like a spot I'm in where I got to kind of show the guys how, how we do things here and kind of just try to help them guide the way so we do things the right way here and kind of become a good, good kind of team, I should say past two years reaching super regionals how easy is it for that to become the bar now and for that to be the measurement of a season um i think even after the first one it was the bar last year so now that we've done it two years in a row it's kind of a it's not even the it's the bar it's the expectation now where if we don't um i mean yeah i mean it's the expectation to be there and go to college world series in omaha how's it feel going into your third year i feel like it was just yesterday you, you enrolled here yeah, um, I mean, these past two years have flown by. I mean, I still feel like I was in College Station yesterday. So, um, yeah, I mean, excited to be here. Good. Can't believe it's already been my third year now. What uh, Over the offseason, what, what were you trying to work on? Just what do you feel like you did? Um, just tried to get stronger, um, really just lift and eat and trying to get, um, maintain, get bigger, get stronger. Um, and kind of, yeah, just working with Coach Hawk and Daryl on what I should be doing over the summer, getting – getting better on the mound, off the mound, whatever it is. So specific you're working toward, are you, I mean, are you literally thinking, hey, I, I want to be the Friday guy? Um, yeah, absolutely. I mean, that's definitely in the back of my mind. Um, I want to be a good teammate first and try and get everyone better. But um, I mean, yeah, obviously want to come the Friday guy and help this team win a national championship. First full off season working with Hawk, just how was that? And what, what were kind of the message he was relaying to you over the, over the summer? Um, it was great. I mean, yeah, definitely stayed in touch with him often, kind of kept track of how Summer was going, um, shut down for a little bit, um, gave the arm a little bit of rest, and then kind of kept in touch of how to come back, rebuild, and um, get ready for season. We talked to Waz a little bit about the overall schedule of this fall season, but what did what do the next few months look for you specifically or the pitching staff? Um, kind of just kind of getting the lay of the land. I mean, obviously, we have a lot of pitchers this fall, a lot of new guys, a lot of old guys, so um, kind of just figuring out what everyone needs to work on personally and kind of getting after it in scrimmages, whoever, it, whether that's the first scrimmage or whether it's the last scrimmage, it's all the same, kind of just getting after it. Do you, do you pay much attention to like who Oregon is landing in the transfer portal? You just kind of like get here and say like, all right, new guys. Um, yeah, I mean, I obviously try and pay attention, kind of get in touch with them so we're not totally brand new. But um, I mean, yeah, kind of now that we've all had our first team meeting and everyone's kind of met each other, I mean, now it's we're, all, we're one team, we're ready to go. Is there a different level of confidence for you coming into the season where last year you started the beginning of the season coming out of the bullpen, you put together a full season as a starter and a pretty successful one. Is there a different level of confidence for you off of that back of a strong season starting last year coming into this season and the confidence you bring into this fall camp? Um, yeah, absolutely. I mean, obviously, freshman last year starting in the pen ended up at the end of the year as a starter. Um, I think it brings a sense of um, comfort and confidence kind of helping anyone in the in the pitching staff kind of be in those two different roles kind of helping them navigate how they should go about it um, and yeah just really trying to be a leader for everyone that can. How important is it these fall months as a pitching staff to kind of build confidence with your catchers especially now with you know Bennett gone? Yeah um, it's really big I mean obviously Chase and Anson, Zach Justice returning um, still have three returners um, but obviously with two new catchers um, yeah we got to build Starting from today, got to build relationships with the catchers, build a good foundation for what's coming this season.